Hi, my name is Laura Marsh. I am a public school teacher in the state of Arkansas. I teach social studies. In particular, I teach civics and geography. I am casting my vote this year for Chris Jones. The choice is clear to me. He is the candidate who values teachers. Our other choice is Sarah Huckabee Sanders, who has spent most of her campaign focusing on Arkansas teachers and tearing us down. If you have a child in school, if you know a teacher, if you had a child in school, this ought to make you very upset and angry. The fact that she is building this campaign on tearing schools down. In particular, um, she has not even voiced any kind of statement whatsoever when it comes to teacher salaries. We have uh, teachers in the state that are making less than $38,000 a year as a starting salary. That is less than a correctional officer fresh out of high school with a high school diploma. And so um, we have kids all over the state in rural areas that are having to do classes virtually because they just can't find enough teachers. Sarah has refused to even comment or address this issue. She's also spent a big chunk of her campaign um, airing campaign commercials that have no policy in them that talk about how Arkansas teachers are indoctrinating kids and under Sarah, we will educate kids. Let me take that education part first. Um, if you had talked to any public school teachers, Sarah, you would find out that every single week we are teaching critical reading skills, writing skills, critical thinking skills, test taking skills, and even more. Every week, we are teaching students where they are. We are teaching every Steelingville student that comes into our classroom. We do not cherry pick our students um, like private schools get to do. And so we have the responsibility of teaching every single student. Now, as far as that indoctrination goes, um, I think that uh, we're piggybacking here off this national trend of bashing teachers for teaching critical race theory. Sarah, let me say this to you. We're not teaching critical race theory. We are teaching curriculum. We are teaching history. We are teaching facts. And so as we look through our history, um, we have parts that we're proud of. We have parts that we're less proud of. It's all part of who we are as Americans. It's all part of the story of where we are today and where we're headed in the future. I'm afraid that under a Huckabee administration, teachers could be sued civilly in court for up to two $10,000. Teachers could be sued in court civilly for up to $10,000 for mentioning things like the Three-Fifths Compromise, the um, expansion of the right to vote, the civil rights movement. These topics are deemed controversial and apparently they want us to stick with things that are not controversial, which is the glorious story of our founding fathers. And as important as that story is, it's not the whole story and kids know it. I think if we give kids the truth, they can handle the truth and they can handle the facts. And so the choice is clear as we head towards election day. My vote is for Chris Jones. He talks to teachers, he listens to teachers, he supports teacher raises. He has a program to bring more teachers into rural Arkansas so kids won't have to go to virtual schools. And finally, um, Chris Jones is not supportive of the voucher program that Sarah would um, support that would allow students to have um, their choice to go to a private school, which could possibly decimate Friday night lights, bands, cheerleading, and other school programs. I'm casting my vote for Chris Jones. I'm Laura Marsh. Thank you.